on, right? Yeah, yeah it's on. So Cyber and Lahance, new commentators for uh, Winners Finals. And we're getting right into it. Uh, TL Oreo versus Q. Yeah, Roy and Krom again. Wow. Yeah, lots of Roy's and Krom's. Yeah. Especially since Katakiri isn't here to uh, take him out. Oh, yeah. Me, Gunner. Ugh. But um, anyways, TL Oreo is going to get the first stock. And... Yeah, that was a really fast stock. Just giving Krom. Yeah, throwing out a lot of neutral layers. They're really trying to approach with that, but TL Oreo is going to punish. Yeah. Roy and Krom definitely known for their neutral air combos. Yeah. Oh! Ooh. I almost got that read. Good shield by Oreo, I, otherwise. I mean, I think he would have lived. I think he would have got the sour spot. Yeah, but anyways, tons the of The counter, damage. yeah. That, is that it? Yeah, that's actually it right there. Man, that counter really is the bane of uh, Again, another Krom's fast recovery. It's just, ugh. Yeah, and another fast stock coming out from Oreo. It's not looking yeah, close Yeah, Krom right and Roy, now. they live fast and they die fast. I'll say that much. Yeah, lots of up airs coming yeah. out from these guys. Juggles going on. Already got him at pretty much 60%. Yeah, a lot of action up there on the uh, Smashville platform. And, ooh, that was nearly a punish. And is that it? This might be it here. Oh. Yeah, he's, he's dead. He's not going to make it back. And a three stock. From, yeah, really uh, unfortunate predicament there for uh, Q. Just every time he tried to recover, it was just counter, counter, counter. Like, what are you going to do? Like, yeah. that's the only real, <clears throat> excuse me, recovery option. Yeah, he kept getting hit too far out to just air dodge to ledge or anything like that. So he had to do that. And, of course, he got blown up by a counter. Both players staying their characters. So we'll see how uh, game two goes. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure if Q even has other characters aside from Little Mac, which I do not think we'll see. Yeah. Oreo, of course, he has a ton of characters, but he is going all Roy today, so he's not going to switch. Yeah. As you might have heard earlier, um, Oreo is very committal to his characters. When he's when he says he's gonna pick somebody, he does, and he goes with them the whole day. Whoa! Tried <laughs> to get a little fancy with the neutral B there, but yep. Krom just said no. Yeah, Q responding with the up B, twenty-six point four percent. Another up B, good damage. Yeah, already getting almost as much damage as he got the entirety of the Ooh, last. Oh, good grab round. for the edge guard! And oh, great tech from uh, Oreo. Could have been it. Oh, and Q's already doing better than he did last game. He only got like 80% on the first game. And oh, unfortunately loses the stock despite being in a lower percent. This matchup is just really volatile, and sure enough, yeah, both back at 0% on their second stock. Yeah, F-Tilt doing the job there. It comes off ledge with Nair. Doesn't get much off of it, though. And wow, quite a few forward airs coming out yeah, there. Yeah, I think it was like three forward airs putting them off stage. Yeah, Oreo really putting on the pressure, but um, Q responding back with a triple up air string. Wow. Yeah, that was pretty good. He uh, down through him, waited just a little bit, and got the up air. Yeah, just this up air juggling is working out really well for Q right now. I don't. Uh, yeah, no, Oreo didn't have his jump, but Q went off stage. Yeah, it's basically dead even right now. Both players are just racking up a ton of damage. The side beat, yeah, gonna that, kill. That'll take it. He did get the strong hit. Yeah, Unfortunate that's, for Q. Yeah, that sweet spot really comes in handy in those situations. Yeah, when you're backed up against the ledge like that, you have nowhere and, to go. Oh! Q giving Oreo a taste of his own medicine, and um... This might be it. Oh, no, he's oh, fine. Yeah, manages to clip him with the return hit. Yeah. You see things are slowing down just a tad here. Yeah, Q's... Oreo really does not want to lose that second stock right now. Is that and, it? Yeah, no, yeah. he could not recover from there. Could not make it back, Didn't unfortunately. Didn't even try. So it's going to go up 2-0 uh, in Oreo's favor. This is best of five since it's uh, winner's finals. Yeah. So Oreo just needs one more game to win. What? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, and it's not super late. <laughs> yeah. And Q still confident in his Krom. Yeah, Krom Roy. I mean, he did, he did better that game, uh, you know, coming off of game one. Uh, so going into game three, he's probably hoping he can make just a few more adjustments. Oh, that clank there. That was a little awkward. <laughs> yeah, I'll be clanking with down tilt there. Yeah. Not that one, though. 26.4. Yeah, you can sort of see that they're playing a little bit more patiently now. They're not, like, rushing in as much. They're not trying to extend their combos that long. Just pretty fundamental gameplay at this point. Oh, wow, just waiting really for the nice. get up. 
That was really clever by Oreo. And, oh, not Almost. dead yet, but... Counters coming through. Really yep. bad situation. Oh, but the low recovery is going to help. Yeah, super low recovery there. Does help Krom get out of those situations yeah. sometimes. The back air. And, whoa. Oh, oh it doesn't get the spike hit. Surprise, that wasn't a Krom aside. I mean, he wouldn't have died anyways. He landed on stage. Yeah. Oh, there's the back air. But he does get the edge guard with the back air. Krom, finally, the stock lead. And, oh. <laughs> up V's right as he walks up to him and gets countered. Doesn't die, though. Oh, nice neutral air to interrupt the side B. There's up, the up B out of shield. Yeah. See a lot of up B's coming out from Q. So it's one of his signature nope. moves. And of course, Oreo's looking for that F tilt, one of Roy's best kill options. Yeah, or just the a side, raw B. side B. Yeah, Calling side B is a approach. great move. Yeah, he just called out that approach. Like Q, like Q likes to do, one of the more aggressive players in Columbus. Yeah, the up B. <laughs> Oh, nice jab back here. Sending him off stage. Yeah, the forward throw. And Oreo in a little bit of an interesting position here. Oh, I think oh. he wanted to back air and messed up. He yeah. probably wanted jab back air, would have killed. Oh. Q oh. doing a great job with these grabs. Yeah, he's got a lot of uh, damage off from grabbing him. Oh. oh, no, he clipped him. And oh, but the low recovery going to save him again. Yeah, it looks like Q has, has caught on to that. Yeah. He, he can go just a bit lower and still recover without getting oh, killed. Oh, parried it and almost dies anyways. Oh, that up B. <laughs> At like 70%. The air dodge and the up B and... Oh, that kind of cost him. Yeah, Q faded back just enough to miss the counter. Yeah, Q's starting to adapt just a little bit. And that's all he needs to um, get back on stage. Yeah, it's the, it's the little micro spacing things that's going to help Krom, you know, avoid getting gimped every single time. Down till into back air. Nice, the cross up, and, and that's it. Yep. Yep. Got caught in the up B. Q takes his first game of the set. Now it's two to one Oreo. Yeah, and I mean, that was, uh, wasn't as close of a game. I mean, he did two stock him. Yeah. So, yeah, Q looks like he's making the proper adjustments, especially when it comes to his uh, recovery and the spacing on it. Yeah, that, that was what saved him that game. Was that he adjusted, you know, just the way that he did to uh, throw Oreo off when he was trying to counter. You got that little bit of extra damage, and that was what he needed to win. Oh, we're going to uh, Yoshi's, what is this one, Islands? I think it's Story. Oh, yeah, this is Story. Never mind. Yeah. yeah. Yoshi's Story, similar to Battlefield, just has slanted edges. Yeah. Oreo some major damage early on, just, yeah. You gotta hold Man. shield with those multi hits. You can't just drop it. Well, sometimes it shield pokes, so. Yeah. You gotta be careful with it, of that, too. Nice parry, and. Oh, went for the early kill with the side beat. And, oh! Yeah, he was too low. Just a hair too low, and that's gotta be really frustrating for Q. He's gonna have to figure something out to make the comeback here. Uh oh, there just it is. Charge <laughs> just charge a side smash! Just run know? up and charge forward smash. Sometimes it's those unexpected options that really pay off. Especially when you get later in the bracket and you get to that higher level of play, you know. If you throw something out like that, oh, then they... <laughs> Oreo trying to take a page out of his book, going for the F smash there. But yeah, Q was more than ready for that. The side beat. Oh, Ooh. that is so strong. It's so powerful. And the count... Oh, yeah, that slanted edge missed. really helps Q. Gets back on stage. Up B. Yeah. Tons of damage, of course. Just holding shield. I'm not sure. His plan oh, was there, but... parry to F-Smash, and it doesn't kill. Yeah. It was across stage. Yeah, Oreo really could have used oh, that, but... Reads the roll. That was a hard call out on the F-Smash. It's a rare move you see from Roy's F-Smash. Yeah, Oreo feeling confident with the taunt, and he's trying to run all over Q now, but can Q bring it back? Yeah, he's going to need an, another early kill like he got on that first game. I mean, the first uh, stock. Yeah, rolls into the up -E again. I mean, the... Uh, up smash, excuse me. But yeah, it's going to be some more crucial damage to his stock. Nair gets both hits. Whoa. Oh, oh, taunt into F smash. Q, you got you got to be careful. You cannot be baited that easily. Yep, got to remember you can cancel those taunts in this game. Yeah. Nice the back air. This and is, this is Q's, stocks. Q's chance to make it to grand finals winner side. Yeah. Oh. Of course, Krom can put on a ton of damage. Oh, yeah. No and take about early it. stocks. He is Roy's Echo Fighter, after all. Yep. As often as we may forget that. 
I mean, Q's... Yeah, Q just trying to play really patient. Usually he's a like really heavy rushdown guy, but right now like he knows this. He just really wants to. Oh, no. Whoa! He tried to space it low enough to not get countered. That's really unfortunate for Q, but uh, yeah, or you're gonna take that set three to one. Good job to both players. Yeah. And uh, we're gonna see losers semis now, right?